Hi everyone, Phil from Tech for Techs here. Today we're going to be looking at this. What is it? Well, it's an Acasa USB 3.1 Gen 2 USB adapter cable. Basically, it's an internal cable which basically you plug into the motherboard on your PC and then you basically slot this in the back of your PC onto the case and it gives you a USB Type-C connector or more specifically a USB 3.1 Gen 2 USB Type connector so for really really high speeds. Okay, so we're going to have a look at this Acasa USB 3.1 Gen 2 internal adapter cable. It plugs directly into a USB 3.1 Type-C header on the motherboard. So you won't plug it into your standard USB 3.0, USB 2.0 header. It will need a specific one and I'll show you what that looks like in a few minutes. Also on here it says USB 3.1 super speed, fast charging, 10 gigabits per second. Type-C double-sided plug, um, it says about the USB 3.1 Type-C, shows you a little picture of it there, you can't see much of the products inside this shiny bag, would have preferred the front bit to be clear so you can actually see it a little bit better, and the back there's not much there at all to be honest, so let's open it up and have a look what we've got. Okay, this is what you've got in the bag. There's not much. You've basically got the screw, uh, which will allow you to screw that into your case. And then you've got the adapter cable itself. So basically, you've got that header connection there, which you can see there. That's what plugs into your motherboard. As you can see, it's not the same as a standard USB Type um, 3 or USB 2.0 or anything like that. And then you've got a cable, which is roughly around about 45 centimetres on the attached to this back plate, which then obviously slides into the back of your computer. Uh, as you can see, there's not much to it. It's basically a cable screwed into an adapter. Um, but as you can see there, um, you've got the port there. So that's your USB 3.1. Gen 2. So then you'd be able to plug in obviously any USB 3.1 Gen 2 type C devices into it. So it basically all it does is add the facility to your PC. And nice to see the actual plate is in black rather than silver because most cases these days are generally black so it will match in. Only catches if you've got a white case it might stand out a little bit. Okay this is your USB 3.1 Gen 2 USB header here and as you can see it looks slightly different than what uh, a standard USB 3 header over here so you they are not interchangeable and you're not going to be able to use a USB 2 device in there either this is specifically for USB 3.1 uh, Gen 2 um, so yeah well Gen 1 or Gen 2 but basically you plug them into there uh, and that obviously works as the connector um, so you get your cable, which looks like this, okay, and then all you do is plug it in, you just push it, quite hard to see with my hands, but you just push it straight down and it clicks in, okay, and it's as simple as that, and they're in pretty sturdy as well, there's no little clips on them or anything like that, they don't seem to pull out easily, you have to give them a good tug for it to come out. So again, you just basically push the header into the board, bang, uh, and away you go. Uh, and then what you do is then get your plate, and you would then screw that plate in to the back of your PC. Um, obviously, at the moment, we've took out the graphics card so you can see easier, but there would normally be a graphics card there. So you get your back plate, and you position it to the back of the case, slide it down, it doesn't connect to anything, it's just basically hanging off the back, and then you get the screw they supplied, and screw it in. Bear in mind if you've already got a back plate, one of these in, you'll have to take the screw out and just pull it out so you can fit this in. And once it's in, well hey, you're up and running. One thing I have noticed though, the way they have done it, 
is the writing is actually upside down on the back of the case. Yeah, so unless you've got a, a really strange case where the motherboard fits in the wrong way round, the writing on the back of the plate is wrong. So let me just show you that. So if I stand this case up, spin it around. Lower the camera down so you can see. You can see it there. The writing is upside down and there's no way to reverse that. So someone must have had a bad day at the office when they designed that and they were like, mm, which way round do we put the writing on it? Well, they got it wrong this time. Um, but you've got your USB header there. So basically you just plug in your USB device into that and away you go.